मल्टीपल चॉइस क्वेश्चन ऑन न्यूमेरिकल मेथड्स एंड इट्स एप्लीकेशन कंसिडर फर्स्ट एग्जाम्पल बुझियो दिस इज एक्स एंड वाई से जीरो वन टू एंड थ्री इट इज द वैल्यू ऑफ वाईज आर वन थ्री एट नाइन फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ डेल्टा स्क्वेर वाई जीरो सो दिस इज द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स जीरो दिस इज वाई जीरो वाई वन वाई टू वाई थ्री एंड वी वॉन्ट टू रिटर माइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ डेल्टा स्क्वेर वाई जीरो सो यू कैन फाइंड दिस वैल्यू बाई यूजिंग टू टेक्निक्स द फर्स्ट टेक्निक इज यू इफ यू फाइंड अ फॉरवर्ड डिफरेंस टेबल बाई यूजिंग फॉरवर्ड डिफरेंस टेबल So this is x zero y zero, no oh, x y sorry not x zero y zero it is x and y. It is zero one two three. The values of y are one three eight nine. Then delta y is equal to three minus one it is two eight minus three five. Nine uh, minus eight, it is one, and delta square y is equal to three, and minus four, and so on. So what is the delta square y zero? Delta square y zero is equal to three. So this is what answer. Delta square y zero equal to three. In uh, in other way, in the second technique, second technique we know that delta y zero equal to y one minus uh, y zero. And therefore, delta square y zero is equal to delta times delta y zero. So it is equal to delta times y one minus y zero, which is equal to delta y one minus delta y zero, which is equal to y two minus y one minus y one minus y zero. So this is equal to y two minus two y one plus y zero. So the delta square y zero is equal to Y two minus two times y one plus y zero. So y two is equal to uh, what is the value of y two here? Y two is eight. Y two is eight minus two times y one. Y one is equal to three plus y zero. Y zero is equal to one. So it is equal to. Eight minus six plus one, so nine minus six is equal to what? Three. So this is the second technique by using you can find a delta square uh, y zero. Now the next, next number two, we know that the first forward difference a delta x uh, or the function f of x is equal to we know that or delta f of x is equal to. f of x plus h minus f of x and therefore if we consider a polynomial of degree one then its first forward difference is x plus h minus x so it is equal to what h it is constant so if the degree is one degree is one then its first forward difference forward difference is one similarly If degree is n, degree of the uh, degree of the given function of function is n, then its nth difference, nth difference is constant. Nth difference is constant, and n plus one and higher difference. And higher difference is zero. Is what zero? So here, if the degree of the given function is n, then its nth difference is equal to what? Uh, constant. Now next, next uh, we know that again. Uh, 
if you want to determine delta cube of or uh, say uh, sorry delta square of say 1 minus uh, twice x and 1 minus thrice x then it is equal to it is equal to here it is equal to uh, minus 2 into minus 3 that is the coefficient of x square is equal to 6 x square okay into 2 factorial so it is equal to what 2 into 3 it is 6 into 2 factorial okay similarly if you want to determine delta raised to 4 of 1 minus x then 1 minus uh, say thrice x 1 minus say 4x and 1 minus say uh, 10x then uh, its fourth difference is equal to so the coefficients are minus 1 minus 3 minus 4 minus 10 so it is equal to 40 into 3 it is 120 into uh, 4 factorial okay so this is what the fourth difference uh, difference forward difference of the given uh, function again uh, next uh, we want to uh, determine okay the derivative of the function say here find the dy by dx dx at x is equal to 3 from the given table say the table is x y x is equal to 1 2 3 4 and y is equal to 3 6 9 12 then then here uh, the we want to determine derivative so first we want to determine the forward difference table so the forward difference table is equal to x y it is 1 3 6 9 uh, 1 3 uh, sorry 1 2 3 4 3 6 9 12 the first forward difference is equal to 3 3 3 3 and the next difference delta square y is 0 0 0 0 and therefore dy by dx is equal to uh, dy by dx is equal to 1 by uh, h uh, or i am writing here del dy by dx is equal to 1 by h inside the bracket delta y 0 plus uh, minus 1 by 2 delta square y0 and so on but here uh, the x0 is equal to what I want to determine derivative at x is equal to say x is equal to uh, 3 sorry x is equal to say instead of uh, 3 here sorry I want to determine derivative at x is equal to 2 x is equal to 2 then okay x is equal to 2 then it is equal to 1 by h so the difference is h is 1 here the difference between the x values is 1 so h is 1 so it is 1 by 1 into delta y 0 so which is equal to say delta y 0 is equal to since 2 is a given value 2 is the given value so delta y 0 is equal to 3 so the answer is equal to 3 answer is equal to 3 delta square y 0 is 0 0 okay so we want to determine derivative at given point so the derivative is what 3 now next next um, find the initial approximate value by using next apply trapezoidal rule on the for this table x y x is equal to 1 2 3 y is equal to 0 1 2 so this is x 0 y 0 uh, x 0 x 1 y 0 y 1 uh, y 2 ok so and this is x0, x1, uh, x2 and here the given a is equal to 1, b equal to 3 so h is equal to b minus a divided by n now since there are 3 ordinates 
ordinates and therefore n is equal to 2 so b minus 1 divided by 2 is equal to 2 divided by 2 is equal to 1 so h is equal to 1 h is equal to 1 now uh, the trapezoidal rule is the value of the integration i is equal to h by 2 y0 plus say y0 plus y2 plus 2 times y1 so if you put the value here it is 1 by 2 y0 plus y2 y0 plus y2 is 1 plus 2 plus uh, 2 times y1 so it is 2 plus 2 so the it is equal to uh, 3 plus it is answer is what 5 by 2 okay I am checking it again once again y0 plus y2 so it is y0 sorry 0 y0 is 0 so 2 plus 2 it is 4 by 2 and 4 by 2 is equal to what 2 so the value of uh, this is by using trapezoidal rule the rule okay so uh, next round up the given number We want to round up the given number say uh, 58 58 point two three seven four five six two four decimal places decimal places and and uh, four significant figures significant figures figures so here the four decimal places that is here uh, we want to round up this number to uh, 58 point two three seven now you can see here the fifth uh, decimal uh, play, uh, the value of the fifth decimal places is exactly five but four is even number so if we round this number then it is equal to four decimal places is 58.2374 this is what four decimal places and if you if you want to round up to given number to uh, four significant figure that is 58 point since the given number is 2374 uh, okay sorry i am writing it again 52 point 58 point 2374 now this uh, seven uh, these are the four significant figures but the Fifth significant figure is greater than five, so it is fifty-eight point two four. So this is what round up the given number to four decimal and four significant figures. Now next, find uh, find the equation f of x is equal to solve equation f of x is equal to x cube plus x square plus 4x plus 4 okay using newton raphson method using a newton raphson method with okay with x0 is equal to x0 is equal to uh, 2 find x1 correct up to two decimal places using newton raphson method so we know that here the neutral x1 is equal to x0 minus f of x0 divided by f dash of x0. So x1 is equal to x0, x0 is 2, f of x0 is f of 2 divided by f dash of x0. Now what is f dash x? f dash x is equal to thrice x square plus twice x plus 4 so this is what f dash 2 is equal to so if you solve this x1 is equal to x1 is equal to 2 minus f of 2 so f of 2 is equal to 2 cube 2 cube uh, plus 2 square 2 square plus 4 into 2 plus 4 divided by f dash 2 is equal to 
3 into 2 square plus 2 into 2 plus 4 so if you simplify this if you simplify this then we get and the value of x1 okay using a newton raphson method that is x1 is equal to 2 minus this is 8 plus 4 plus 8 plus 4 divided by this is 12 plus 4 plus 4 so this is equal to 2 divided 2 minus is 1624 divided by uh, 20 so this is 2 minus uh, 6 divided by 5 so this is equal to this is equal to 10 minus 6 divided by 5 so it is equal to 4 by 5 which is equal to 0 0.8 so this is the value of x1 using newton raphson method newton raphson method now next uh, find the uh, solve dy by dx dx is equal to x plus y solve this uh, differential equation okay with given um, given y0 is equal to y0 is equal to 1 then find find y of 0 0.2 using Euler method Euler method so here f of xy equal to if you compare this differential equation with dy by dx is equal to f of xy then f of xy equal to x plus y and given x0 is equal to x0 equal to 0 and y0 is equal to 1 y0 equal to 1 and therefore x1 is equal to x1 is and uh, the difference h is equal to h is equal to given 0 0.1 okay take h is equal to 0 0.1 so the Euler formula x1 is equal to x1 is equal to x0 plus h so this implies x1 is equal to 0 plus 0 0.1 is equal to 0 0.1 and y1 equal to y0 plus h f of x0 y0 and therefore y1 is equal to y0 y0 is 1 plus h h is equal to 0 0.1 into f of x0 y0 is 0 1 so it is 1 plus 0 0.1 and now f of x, x y is x plus y so f of x y is equal to what x plus y so it is equal to 0 plus 1 is equal to 1 plus 0 0.1 which is equal to 1.1 so this is y1 similarly uh, x2 is equal to this is the value of y1 at x1 that is here y of uh, 1 uh, y of 0 0.1 is equal to uh, 1.1 now we want to determine y of 0 0.2 0 0.2 so next next x2 is equal to x1 plus h and uh, what is x2 is equal to x1 plus h so x2 is equal to x1 is equal to 0 0.1 plus h is 0 0.1 so it is 0 0.2 and y2 is equal to y2 is equal to y1 plus h time f of x1 y1 so by using this formula next y2 is equal to y1 is equal to 1.1 okay plus h is 0 0.1 and into f of x1 x1 is equal to uh, x1 is equal to say x1 is 0 uh, x1 is equal to 0 0.1 x1 is 0 0.1 and y1 is 1.1 so by using this 1.1 plus 0 0.1 0 0.1 plus 1.1 since f of x y is x plus y it is equal to 1.1 plus 0 0.1 into 1.2 so this is equal to 1.1 plus 0 0.12 okay it is equal to 1.22 so the value of uh, the given um, 
the for differential equation at 0.2 using Euler method is 1.22 so the next